Okay, Chief, you want to identify yourself and give me a quick little background on your on your involvement with the Iowa as we go up to the signal bridge? Well, I'm a retired Chief Signalman, and I was on the battleship Iowa for two years as a reservist, but I spent many tours on it because I kept asking for more. And uh, matter of fact, I was on the Iowa uh, in 1986 in, in, in New York Harbor, but on the way there, uh, we had gunfire, and uh, what happened on, on Tour 2 was a misfire on Tour 2, and there's always a 10-second countdown. In other words, tell you, you better get inside, right? That's right, and right now get inside, because right. you, you have to be inside the skin of the ship. But however, a 10-second countdown goes 10, 9. You got a lot more than 10 seconds. And and the reason being the concussion from the explosion can maybe kill you? It could. So what happened, I came out of the signal shack because it was between the misfires and I knew I could get inside the skin of the ship on their type of countdown. But it misfired and went off anyway and I was on the ladder and knocked me down to the deck. Knocked you down to the deck. You were on the ladder outside. Out and I'll bet you lost some hearing. Uh, it's still lost. You still have lost hearing. Yeah, VA pays me for it. Wow, there you go. A partial disability gang from a 16-inch <laughs> round going off when it's not supposed to. Not going to signal into the deck. Well, Chief, let's go on up to the signal bridge. Lead the way. Okay. And if you many want... Many times. Many times. Your, your, your feet know this ladder. You knew enough to watch your head on this ladder. Yep. That's why I looked up. I knew it was there. Didn't Old habits. There. That's a good habit. Okay, we're on the weather deck signal bridge. There's your light. One of your lights. There's signal light. A 12 inch light. 12 inch light, yep. Yeah. I can tell you if it's going to be or not. It has been. Oh, yeah, we've worked a lot on this stuff. I've even brass sewed the brass on there, I've done some painting. We painted the uh, footstep down there below. Yeah, it's nice. Funny as a signal mic came up to see if it had been reworked yet. I know, I noticed that. Uh, but what I just sent was INT, which is question mark, Q R D. You send that to another ship and it's asking them, where are you from, where are you bound? Was that signal? Interrogative QRD. Yes. Quebec Romeo Delta. Yeah. That's what it is. Where are you going or where you been? Yeah, matter of fact, away from the Iowa, my wife and I were downtown San Diego one time and I I was given the ship. Semaphore? A Juliet with uh -huh. the hands and they gave me a Charlie and that's what I asked them. And they, they're leaving San Diego going to, to uh, Long Beach. You know, I was I'm just a Sigma or a, just a private person out there and they talked to me. Sweet. It's and that, fun. It's wonderful. Yep. Yeah. Yep. All right. Let's head on over. I just said love you. Okay, this is the signal bag. All the signals are wrong off of here. The flag signals. And what kind of knot is this? That's a proper knot. That, that's a uh, clove hitch. Yep, and uh, all proper. Yep, we're trying to do everything proper here.
We got some trip hazards. This, this is not original teak deck here. This is pine and it shows its wear and tear. But second one will stand on here. So don't don't go so don't go in don't go in there. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, but I'm okay, doing the okay. that's fine. There's an arrow right there. Okay. But the uh the second will stand on here and, and raise the flags or answer the flags from another ship. And uh matter of fact, Captain Larry Sequist was the commanding officer when I was on here. And I made a mistake. We had several ships in our convoy, and we had given the the flat the uh, another ship the 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 I'm sorry I'm, I'm forgetting my words, uh, but they were the ship station ship, and uh, they put up a signal uh, turn three, which means turn 30 degrees to starboard upon completion, and I yelled up at the bridge and I said, Skipper, we've got a signal in the air. And, and I said, it's turn three. At upon completion, it'll be 30 degrees turn to starboard. And he looked down at me and he said, Skipper, because it's so formal here. And I said, I'm sorry, sir. He said, Skipper. I said, I'll be up to have you sign, <laughs> sign the message. And so when I got up there, he looked at me and he says, Skipper. And I says, Captain, I'm sorry, I apologized. And he looked at me on the bridge with all the officers and everything in there and says, Petty Officer Lee, I was a first class then. You can call me Skipper, but you're the only person on the ship that can call me Skipper. Well, what happened later on then on that cruise, I walked out of a hatch. And when I walked out of the hatch, here is Captain Sequist with the Command Master Chief. And I says, good morning, Skipper. And that command master chief was on me quickly. And, and, and uh, this command, uh, uh, anyway, he, he looked at the command master chief and says, now Petty Officer Lee can call me Skipper. He's the only one on the ship That's that can unreal. call me Skipper. He and I are still friends on Facebook. I still call him Skipper. I love it. What a great sea story. <laughs> Listen to that. Awesome. Call him Skipper. Awesome. Well, let's step into the signal shack, and I want you to give me uh, all the feedback you possibly can. Okay, you mean when I trip? <laughs> yeah, just don't. Yeah, just don't trip. I've done it before. <laughs> no, okay, I'm in. No, but I haven't fallen, but I've tripped over it a few times because you're in a hurry. Okay, you got. Of course, some of this is staging. We know this it was staging, but we usually staged an extra one, and there's an extra one there. But it was there. It is. It's always over there. Okay. That was good. Um, man, this looks cleaner than when I was on here. Thank you. <laughs> um, I mean, we sometimes we tried, but didn't get it done. Yeah. Is that where the coffee cups, coffee yeah. cups would have been? That's what that. Mine might still be there. <laughs> no, we we, we stayed. We oh. stayed yeah. Yeah. That's there. That's how we knew who was out there and where they were at, and we and the yeah they're there. The call signs are on there, and uh, yeah, everything is just everything's in place. Oh, I remember that manual. Oh yeah, I found that online. Or we we actually we got more than one. We framed that one because that one I believe is there's a story behind that one. If you want to read that, but oh, I can't okay, that you can't one. read. It's hard. Yeah. Yes, yes. <laughs> nice. Makeover. Done a very nice job. Very, Thank you. Very nice job. Thank you. I can come back and be a signalman. It's so nice. Look at you. Ste step into the supervisor's space there if you'd like to and look I, at the staging I, that was done in there. I've been in there.
confidential equipment. You know, we can't keep, we, right now we have a lot of classified equipment that's just seems to be rolling around the United States. And uh, but that's what we're for. And uh, you guys have really done a nice job. Thank you. I'm gonna go back and take a look here. Yeah, watch it. Watch the overhead there. I'm sure you know that, but yeah, no coffee. Usually, when we had coffee, we just send somebody down to Mestex to get a bunch of. Uh huh. Them. Okay, that's good to know. Uh, we didn't make it up here. One of the reasons is you get in heavy seas and stuff. Then we gotta watch it, tie it down. So everything has to be tight, and so we just send, we just send a lot of people down. Or not a lot of people. We sent people down to get a lot of coffee. Okay. That's what I'm trying to say. Yep. Wow, you guys have done such a nice job. You can be proud of what you've done. Well, thank you. A lot of serious sweat here. We we washed down all the bulkheads with 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 Windex. The floors have been stripped and waxed and buffed, and we painted, cum shod, bought stuff online. Well, you do what you have to do. Yeah, we do. The Navy way. You have done, you know, there's a lot. People think Comstar is not, is not right. But sometimes that's the only way you can you can get things done and if you're going to get underway. Without getting bureaucracy involved. That's right. And you don't want them involved. It takes too long. Yep. Okay. I'm not going to trip. <laughs> And of course, we, this stuff, a lot of this stuff was painted. I stripped it and brassoed it. Yeah, you guys did a nice job. Look, look at this, huh? Yeah. This and this. Yep, get, get to fix the flags. Yep, still got the wash quarter and station bill up. Still got that on the wall. Yeah. Well, yeah. Following in, I was talking on a video. I know you were. Yeah. So, what is all this? This is all the signal shack. This, and it goes into there? Yeah, and I sat in there. That's super bright over there. Yeah, never mind. Thank you for your service, sir. Thank you very much. Okay, stand in front of the clerk's and whatever. I think, Chief, you've done. I think you've done enough video here. I'm going to stop the video. Okay. okay. I think you've you've pretty much done it all. Thank you very well, thank much you for your information. You're very very welcome.